Hey board gamers, BJ from Board Game Gumbo here, back with another Kickstarter line up. That's right, I'm bringing you projects that won't break your budget, but throw in a little something extra. This time, we're battling our way across the battlegrounds of Athanasia. Let's take a look. Athanasia, designed by Brandon Fitzpatrick, is a new battle royale game from first-time publisher Immortality Games. A large green map holds the key to immortality, but as you lead your civilization onto the battlefield, you know that there are up to six other leaders looking to find that eternal objective too. Now, we were provided an early pre-Kickstarter version of the game, so understand that during the project, things could change uh, the components, the bits, even the rules as the project continues. We start with a gridded game board that holds the crafting table, where the immortality key will be forged. Players will start in their home world with their civilization and choose six heroes to represent them in that world. Each hero has a unique amount of health and abilities. Figuring out your best six combos, that's one of the keys to victory. Hey, turns are simple. Players move all their characters, and then they can take three actions. They can choose one active action per character. That's attack, or steal, activate an obelisk, perform a special ability, or use an active item. As you can see, players can attack other characters or even try to steal items from them. Stealing the antimatter and philosopher's stone before the other players use them to craft the immortality key, it might be important, but there's a ton of different items to use and to battle over. For instance, obelisks and watchtowers, they're present on the board, and you'll want to send some of your heroes toward them because obelisks help with movement, attack, and defense, while attack towers help increase your attack range. But all of this has a purpose. How do you win? Well, as any kid who played on the steps of a pool knows, being king of the hill always helps, so be the last civilization alive and you're the winner. Just like any skirmish game, one way to win is to vanquish all of your opponent's heroes. But the other way is very satisfying too, and that's the little bit of line up in this game. Once a player crafts the immortality key, players will fight to activate the key at the exit portal. Whichever civilization does so first wins the game. Hey, so that's an inside look at Athanasia from Immortality Games. Fans of battle skirmish type games, they'll enjoy how the game is built for big play groups to duke it out on the battlefield. In about two hours, up to seven players can attempt to combo their way to victory. With so many civilizations and so many different heroes, there's lots to explore. Until next time, les bon temps roulés.